This portion of the video is sponsored by Dossier. Huge shout outs to them for sponsoring us. Guys, I don't know about you, but I love smelling good. Like, don't tell me I look cute. Don't tell me you like my outfit. Just tell me I smell good. If you give me that compliment, it's just like, it's a big deal. I know I'm cute. I know I dress well, but I just like hearing, you smell amazing. Like, what are you wearing? And guys, fragrances can be really expensive, especially like the higher end you know the bougie vibes it's a little bit expensive if we're being honest so this is where dossier comes in they make fragrances accessible to everyone and i love that they give you high-end fragrances for a fraction of the cost and they do not give you subpar scents it's still the same scent but a fraction of the cost imagine paying uh, for a fragrance for like 300 and something dollars but dossier has the same scent for 40 something dollars like that's amazing I don't know about you, but I'm trying to save my coins, but I also want to smell nice So what I love is that they don't compromise the scent for the price and guys I have three of their fragrances here with me. I've been using them. So the bottles do look a little dingy Especially this one. I've been using this one the most. Oh my god. So I have Amber sage and this one is a replica of Tom Ford FN Fabulous and I've been using this. I love the scent of it. I've always wanted to try that Tom Ford fragrance, but I never wanted to spend the money. So I'm super glad when I saw that they had this in their lineup. They also have Amber, Ambery Cherry. Apparently I love Amber fragrances and I'm just realizing. And this one is a replica of Tom Ford Lost Cherry, which I wanted to try so bad, but I didn't want to spend that 300 and something dollars. Okay, we was not doing that. So this is what I got and I have been using it. Like I've been using this a lot. I love it, it lasts all day. I have sampled the Tom Ford Lost Cherry before and this smells exactly like it and it lasts. Then I have Floral Marshmallow. This one smells like Rihanna. <laughs> Remember when everybody said Rihanna smelled like Love Don't Be Shy? So this is a Love Don't Be Shy replica. I've been using her, as you can see. I've been using them all because they come really filled all the way to the top and I've been using this as well. And this does smell exactly like Love Don't Be Shy. I had Love Don't Be Shy in the travel size, so it smells just like it all the fragrances are spot on and guys any high-end fragrance you can think about they have them in their lineup definitely check their website out and they also have their own niche fragrances that they have launched so definitely check them out and what i love the most like what is just mind-blowing is if you don't like the fragrance after ordering it you can ship it back free of charge and you get your money back nobody will ask you oh why did you didn't like it they literally will ship it free of charge back to the store and to give you your money back and i love that like i love that so yeah huge shout outs to dossier for sponsoring this video and definitely check them out guys definitely get yourself a fragrance if you've been eyeing a fragrance for a long time definitely get it and test it out to see you know if it's for you before like taking the plunge or better yet just save your coins save your coins and get several different options versus just having one for a high price tag thank you dossier again for sponsoring this video let's get into the vlog welcome back to another vlog it is thursday and i decided to start this vlog today i know it's the end of the week but it's gonna be a weekend vlog i literally went to bed so late last night i was up cleaning y'all are gonna see a vlog before this i think a reset vlog i cleaned i clean i clean tired look at my face i am exhausted okay it's like 10 58 it is late i didn't get up this morning till after nine like my body was just not having it and guys i'm starving so the first thing that we're gonna do is go get some coffee and some food starbucks is having a yay date today it starts at 12 o'clock it literally just sent a reminder they start at 12 um and now it's 11 o'clock so do i wait another hour to get my food or just go i mean i need to be getting 50 percent off okay because i buy so much starbucks i need that discount so um i'm wondering if we should wait till 12 o'clock baby this is hard this is hard unless we're just gonna like grab a croissant or something at duncan i can take my own orange juice i can you know what guess what guess what guess what I'm going to pour me some orange juice in my tumbler and we're gonna go buy a croissant 
and have breakfast and then do our other errands and then we're gonna go to Starbucks at 12 foot coffee because we're not paying full price when they have a half price special especially for someone like me can I talk that buys so much coffee anyways guys welcome back to another vlog I don't know what that was about I'm hungry I'm tired and I've just been having a time I've been trying to get so much done <sighs> tired I'm tired if you're new here please subscribe to the channel okay become a part of the ck gang don't leave and don't subscribe girl and also hit that like button hit that comment button say hi in the comments if it's even high say hi say something we need the engagement anyways let me be cheap not cheap i'm being cost effective let me go get my tumbler let me make myself an orange juice and we're gonna go to duncan first grab our croissant eat our breakfast and I have to go to the bank to get a money order. That's what it's called. So we're going to have to go to the bank after that. And I think by the time I get that money order, we can go get our coffee at Starbucks. And then we can head to the post because I need to mail something out. So that's what we're going to do. And guys, I'm supposed to get my dining room chairs today. I'm excited. I'm excited. Let's go. As I'm in the line at Duncan waiting for my croissant. I bought a chicken croissant. And yeah, there's a car in front of me, so we're waiting. And then I'm just gonna pull over and eat. And then we're gonna go to the back. Everything is falling, but let me see. Okay. Everything looks pretty fresh. Okay. And of course, we have our orange juice. Damn, my hand is ashy. Okay, let's just not talk about that. But anyways, we have our orange juice. Do I even have hand cream in the car? I'm gonna look. Guys, I feel brand new. that croissant it did that Ooh. <laughs> like i literally I look so tired anyways um as i was saying like i literally feel brand new that croissant did that and the orange juice was the icing on the cake now it's 11 26 um let's just head to chase um I think I'm gonna go, I was gonna go to the drive-thru, but I think I might walk inside because there's a specific um, person that I wanna see that works there. I just wanted to go say hello to her. I don't know if she's working today, but I met her the last time I went to the bank and she was just such a godsend. So I just wanted to go say hello. I don't know if she's there today. If not, we'll just do the drive-thru. I can't see y'all with my glasses because they have, um, the polarized lens in them so let's do that and then by the time I'm getting done over there it'll probably be like 12 or whatever and then we can go to Starbucks hey babe so she's not working today oh my god and they're like oh she'll be here tomorrow um I'm just like dang I'm not coming tomorrow but anyways I have my cashier's check I, have, I guess this part is the part for you that you keep so now it's 11.50. I really would like to get that coffee before driving to the post because the post office is 20 minutes away. Probably further, especially since I'm not leaving directly from home. But the, oh my, guess what? The item that I'm trying to send off at the post office is not in a car. Okay. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, so we're going to get the coffee and then we're driving to the house to get the envelope that i need to ship oh my goodness all right it's fine 
let me get this coffee because clearly my brain is not it's free coffee brain it's definitely okay i can't believe this because i'm looking over for the envelope it's not in the car we are at starbucks and clearly there is going to be a line well y'all can't really see but there's a line um we are not even close uh but it's 1204 i'm just gonna get my drink maybe that'll wake my senses up and yeah i need to go to the car wash as well i have the pass that i can just run the car through but the last time i went i would i just didn't want to go out in the sun to wipe the car down so i have a whole bunch of little things going on on my car but we might have to go to the car wash tomorrow i don't have it in me to go right now especially the fact that we have to go home to get the document that i need to mail off this is just so wild <laughs> this memory that came up on my phone this is 2018 baby binda bobby wow this is one of my favorite looks oh my goodness Hi, um, can I have a apple crisp oat milk shake and espresso? Could you say that one more time? Can I have a apple crisp oat milk shake and espresso? Yep. What size? What do you want? Uh, grande. Do you, think, do you think that goes well with, um, what you call it? The vanilla sweet cream cold foam? I usually get it on the brown sugar one. Do you think it blends well with the apple? Oh, absolutely. Yes. Okay, I'll do that. You want to add the foam on there? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And do you have the pumpkin cream cheese muffin? Yes. And I'll have one of those, please. And do you want it warmed up? Yes, please. Police. Call the police. Police. Call the police on me, bro. Tell me why. I came home. Ugh. I came home, went upstairs, used the bathroom, put my stuff down, put the milk in the house. Oh, we're going to the post office again. Come in the car. Girl, why did I leave the envelope that I needed in the house? So I just had to go back upstairs again. And it's so hot. I need to take off this yoga jacket because it's, it's really hot. But we're going to head to the post office right now. And it's already like minutes to 1 p.m. By the time we get to the post, it's gonna be after one. It is so hot. I totally forgot you guys in the car. Um, I did go home, <sighs> change my clothes. What else did I do? I don't know, but I rested just a little bit, put some clothes in the washer, and then now I am at the gym. I just pulled up to the gym, so I'm gonna go work out. We have a uh, upper body day, so that's what we're gonna go do, and then I'm gonna come back, because I need to go home and make the salmon. I have to record and I didn't record that video, but I'm gonna go get this workout, then we're gonna go cook. And if I don't get to record that hair video today, I'll just um, do it tomorrow. But the rest of the evening, I will edit that video that I created yesterday. It's like always something to do, but I'll see you guys after the workout. There's quite a few people I can see from here in the gym. There's that, that's fun. So I won't take you guys, but I'll be back. Hey babes, I'm back from the gym. Can you tell it was not a heavy session? Usually I'm so sweaty. I don't know, maybe the air conditioner was working today because I'm not sweaty at all. We did a upper body day, so it wasn't too crazy. I did get two, I did get two packages. Um, one is hair, definitely. It's from my hair company. Uh, can I find, hold on, let me find a scissor. And then I did get a package from Amazon, but... It's nothing exciting. It's literally protein. My protein that I usually get is out of stock. I have it on, what's that thing called? Like they send it to me like every couple of, what is that thing called? It's on a schedule. So I skipped last month because I had so much. And then now they don't have it this month. So I can't get my delivery. So I went and decided to try the blessed protein. Oh my god, it has a lot of not so great like things in the comments after I bought it that, that was talking about the flavor. Why is it so hard? Is this like expired? That's definitely not a good sign. I got it because it said it had like 40 grams of plant protein, which is unheard of. But the kicker is you have to make two servings to get that. But it's hard. Like, you, you don't think that's weird? Why is it... Like it literally has like lumps in it. Oh shoot guys, that's not lumps. That's the scoop, wait. It's the scoop. Yeah, I'm wondering, I'm like what kind of lump is this? Oh my God, my bad. Let's pray for the best. 
and I did not know it was by EHP Labs because they're the ones that make Oxy Shred and all those things. So I'm guessing it's good. I hope it's good. I hope it's good. So we're gonna try this. And my other thing is a wig. That much I know. I'm gonna go cook the salmon right now, guys. I'm starving. So we're gonna go try to make the coconut curry. That's what it's called. Salmon. I saw this recipe on YouTube, y'all. So we're gonna try making it. I hope it turns out. Oh. 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 Okay. Yeah. Wig. Yeah, we'll see this later. Um, let me go cook. I'm sorry, it smells what it smells like. I don't know what it smells like. It smells like a cinnamon, so they're right. Um it do smell like a cinnamon. It doesn't taste bad. It's very sweet. Oh my god. It does have cinnamon. <laughs> I don't know. has a weird little taste but you know what we're gonna drink it it is what it is we need the protein and then we're gonna cook dinner guys i'm done making the salmon but i'm mad because it fell apart I think because I bought the salmon um, like two days ago and it was fresh and I put it in the freezer. I should not have put it in the freezer. And then I had to put it in like water to get it thawed out. So my whole thing fell apart, but um, it's still fine. It's still gonna be good. Guys, so this is what it's looking like. I'm mad. Like, I don't know if y'all can see. Oh my God. Um, because it broke up so much. And I think because it was frozen, it was fresh, then I froze it, and then I tried to like thaw it out, and I added so much water to thaw it out. But you know what? I think it's still gonna be super delicious, lots of flavor, and now I have food for like four servings, so that's amazing. Hey babes, happy, happy Sunday. I know the last time you saw me it was Thursday, but I was doing some work and a whole bunch of stuff. So it's Sunday. I just came from church like maybe like 30 minutes ago. I was just like laying down on the sofa. I feel super tired. I don't know why. Um, I was also trying to edit a reel that I have to post for Shein. Um, it's not clothes. It's like a wig that I did and they want me to do a reel as well. Um, yeah, but anyways, right now I'm about to head to the clubhouse. I wanted to let you guys know what was going on. My dining chairs, like I told you on Thursday that they were getting delivered. They got delivered on Friday, but FedEx, but FedEx does what they do best. They literally left it in the clubhouse and I was not able to retrieve them. Okay. So Noel is on the way. He told me he's like 10 minutes out. So I'm going to meet him by the clubhouse and he's going to help me. I have three dining chairs. I did get three from the company and I do intend to buy another one, but let's go. He's kind of in a brush. So I'm going to head over there right now and let's get these dining chairs up the stairs. We got two look at you <laughs> we're gonna get the other one because it can't fit so hey babe so noelle just left um we have the chairs they're right over there behind me i'm gonna do a quick unboxing i'm so thankful for my friend because baby those chairs were going to stay in the package room because who's gonna bring them upstairs <laughs> anyways a huge shout outs to Dea lane for sponsoring us with these chairs these chairs are so beautiful and i'm excited to open them i do have three and i'm just gonna see how they fit and vibe with the place i do intend to get a fourth chair but for now we're using three of these chairs and this is their dove i believe dining chair i will leave all the links in the description box below so definitely check them out
goodness, guys, I am in love. It has a beautiful linen texture. Wow. The chairs are pretty lightweight. They are not like soft and squishy at all. They're pretty firm, but I don't mind because they look so good. Love the shape of the chair with the round table. But the thing about it is my um, area for my dining table is not the biggest. So I'm trying to figure out how to fix the chairs so I can still open the dishwasher. There is that debate. Um, and then if I take the table and pull it further down, it'll be like off center to the curtain. So that's the dilemma. But I really love the curvature of these chairs. I love the shape. And they're just super lightweight. And they just feel so luxe. And then they have the little things on the bottoms to protect the floors. So I really love these chairs. Let's see. Let me sit. So we are sitting pretty firm. It comes up to, you know, your back area, scoops you in really nicely. It's a nice little area to sit. I can see myself sitting here and having some coffee. The chairs are not, I'm, they're not soft. I just want you to know that. Let me put that out there. They're very like firm, but I don't mind. Guys, this is how I decided to set the chairs. And I think I love them. With the three, I was able to do a little like, you know, a little vibe, and then I can still go into the dishwasher, so that's perfect. I think the chairs look so good. They are so aesthetic to look at. Hey guys, good morning. It is a Monday. I'm about to take Paxson to his grooming appointment. It's 8.38. His appointment is at 9 o'clock. We just got in the car. So you know we're not going to get there at 9. But that's okay. Um, I'm about to leave right now. And then right afterwards, I have a waxing appointment. I literally got up, jumped in the shower, switched into some clothes. I'm wearing sweats and just like a tank top because I'm going to go get a wax. Nothing special. I'm going to drop Paxson off and then... Um, his appointment is at 9, my wax appointment is at 9.30, so that gives me enough time to drive to my appointment. The lighting is pretty bad, but I just wanted to let you guys know what was up, where we at, and what is going on. I told him not to jump on the seat. He needs a bath, and he just went right up there like, girl, you're not talking to me. You, I'm not talking to you, right? You run this? Mm-mm. Guys, we're three minutes away. It's 9.04. Well, we're two minutes now. We're going to get there at 9.06, which is good time. I was just having my um, my protein. I'm starving. I had that, and I'm super hungry. I don't know why, but anyways, the light is on green. Let's go. Babes, I just dropped Paxson off. I'm still sitting across from Wolfgang. Um, so I told him to give him a mini groom and not cut his hair. I'm trying to see if I can grow his hair back, even though... When Paxton has a lot of hair, it doesn't work out because he doesn't like brushing his hair. 
and we fight so let's see how that goes i have 15 minutes to head to my wax appointment so i'm just gonna head over there right now it's a lot of traffic like guys early morning is crazy i never am outside at like eight or seven there's so much traffic because everybody's going to work oh my god it took us a while to get here and there were so many cars on the road but um i'm gonna get to my wax appointment um and then i'll check in back hey guys i just got back in the car i did get my wax it is a little later right now it's it's what it's what time is it it's 10 47 i did get my wax and i'm at like this plaza i went to ulta ulta is behind me i went to ulta to return some things return right why did i come out with stuff i was trying to find a lip liner the lip liner that i use the nyx lip liner in coco i cannot seem to find it anywhere so i went ahead and got this juvia's place lip liner from them this isn't in, in the color cola I don't know the lady in there was saying their products are pretty good so we're gonna try i also got this lip oil you know they have like five to six different lip oils in they are like different scents like watermelon i think honeydew some other things i don't know they have like flavors like fru fruity flavors for their lip oils so i picked the watermelon one up and we're gonna try it my lips are so dry, y'all. I'm starving. I'm starving. Um, they didn't call me to pick Paxson up as yet, so that's good. I'm using the time to run like a few errands. I want to try this lip oil, and my mouth is so dry. My mouth is really, really dry. I mean, I'm probably like dehydrated or something. I don't know. I need to do a lip scrub. Oh my god. My lips are super flaky. Let's drink some water because, mm -mm. Okay, I'm back to trying the lip oil because how am I showing y'all the lip oil when my mouth is dry? How much was this? Um, oh, it was $10. I mean... There's not a lot of product in this bottle. Juvia's Place. That's so little. But I'm going to try it. Probably now is not the best time to try because my mouth is so dry. Oh! It feels not... Ah! Dry lips where? Babes. My lips feel so good. What the heck? Oh my god. And he tastes like watermelon. Oh my goodness. Okay, I have been under a rock. Have y'all seen this lip oil before from Juvia's Place? Because where have I been? Mm. Yeah. And it tastes nice. You know, if you like kissing somebody... They're going to be like, wow, your lips are so soft and your lips taste like watermelon. Wow, this is nice. It is hydrating. It says hydrating and nourishing. It actually is. My lips feel so much better. And just now they were really cracky and nasty. And yeah, that was not it. And it feels revived. Oh my God. Anyways, I got the um the hand sanitizer that I be seeing everybody with. I got it in lavender. So let's try. It's so cute. How much was this? Hmm, $10. Oh, it is smell good, baby. You can't talk to me anyhow. This is now I see why people get it. It is so aesthetically pleasing, so slim, and just nice. And the lady told me, like, there was a specific scent that everyone always tries to get. But they were, like, sold out of it. Like, the person that helped me in Ulta just now, she was so nice. Love her. I wish I got her name. She was so, so nice. Like, she kept leaving the counter to come, like, tend to me. And we were searching through a lot of um, different, what you call it, different lip liners just to find the perfect brown. And I think we found it. Ulta has some really huge bags. I brought one in there to return my stuff. And I told her to throw it in the garbage. So when I was leaving, I didn't get a bag because... I didn't want that huge bag again because these were the three things that I got. So that's cute. 
Hey guys, my waxing lady, let me tell you, is the best. She gives you this care package every time. If you are in Orlando, definitely check her out. And yeah, okay, Studios Fire. Like, she gives you this care package, right? This is like a exfoliating thing to exfoliate yourself. And she also gives you these washcloths just to wipe your, you know, your private parts and to keep it clean. You know, you want to keep your your body clean after your wax especially in the first 24 hours you want to keep the area really clean she gives you candy listen i'd be eating these these candies at random times like she gives you candy wait so good i definitely just like love her i mean i do drive 30 minutes well 20 something minutes i'm being extra to come to her still even though we don't live downtown yeah so that was what i got oh and i got this thing guys i wow six minutes already with me just yapping but it's okay it's okay we need to talk i got this thing i usually get pfb from her it's the thing that you use um to like after your shower you apply it so like you roll it and then you rub it into your skin it helps with ingrowns and stuff like that but they have a new one um well maybe they always had it but she's selling it now this is pfb chroma bright and it is um skin brightening ingrown hair relief waxing slash razor bumps and it is for men and women so you're gonna be applying this um but you gotta wait 24 hours because this will burn the heck out of your skin so you're supposed to apply it for it on the dark spots once a day massage it in and do not wash it off and it says results may take up to two months but this is supposed to reduce the appearance of dark spots that is caused by ingrown hair razor bumps and stuff like that you know laser hair removal like any of the hair removal techniques that you use this will help so i'm going to take a picture today when i go home of my you know my girl and I'm going to start using this product tomorrow and I'm going to update y'all <laughs> and let you know if it works. It was for $35. Um, she told me I can use it on my underarms so that I can share with you guys because I have like discoloration and a lot of stuff going on in my underarms. I do need to wax my underarms which we will do but I'm going to start using it under there as well. So I'm hoping for underarms look nice and start to you know like look more even anyways i'm gonna go grab something to eat y'all i ended up going with regular spicy this is spicy just regular nuggets versus um grilled i didn't feel like eating that and then i got orange juice but i put it in here so i'm just gonna hurry and have this and go get paxton because he ready guys look who's here paxton please sit down Thank you. Like, I put him in the back, and by the time I got around to the front, he was in the front seat. He's like, I took a shower. I look good. I'm going to sit up front, period. Sir, Pac said, sit down. I think he's smelling um, the Chick-fil-A. You want to go eat your food? You didn't eat this morning, right? We're going to go let you get your food. Look at you. I didn't cut his hair today. Um, he got a groom, a mini groom. Sit, Pax, and sit. But I didn't trim his hair, so... We're doing the fluffy look. Let's see how that goes. Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday. Um, you guys are de <laughs> you guys are definitely in the cup holder because I don't know where else to put my camera right now. And I didn't repurchase another um, one of those little stands. But it's pretty early, y'all. It's like nine o'clock right now. I got up earlier today. Uh, took Paxton on his walk and stuff. Now we're in the car. I'm going to run to do some errands. Like, literally, I just put some leggings on, a workout top, and my little jacket. Nothing special. I have some stuff to return to TJ Maxx. I really want to go get my money back, so we're going to return those. I am also... Is this even in focus? Go ahead, Mercy. Is it? Okay, I think now I'm in focus. I am also going to Target. That's the first stop. And I want to go to Trader Joe's, guys. I made a whole grocery, grocery, whatever. I made a whole list. Um, and I'm just like, should I just go? There's nothing in the house. Anyway, so I'm thinking I might actually just drive to Trader Joe's. But the thing about it is the target is so far from the Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's is like 
a whole 30 minute ride from my house which is just disgusting i need to talk to the owners because they need to open one somewhere over here so there's that um I'm tired. I'm not tired. I'm hungry. I just feel hungry. Let's just say that. I'm not tired. I really am tired. I'm not tired, okay? I'm just hungry. Uh, I'm going to get a little bit of coffee on the way. And then I'm going to go to Target. I'm trying to get some pajamas from Target. Um, like the little above the stars one, the little plain ones. Uh, they have like the dress version with the buttons. And then the maybe the shorts with the buttons. I need something with buttons in the front. So we're going to get that. I also want to get like a little bag from TJ Maxx. Um, I don't have any small like traveling bags. I only have like a big suitcase and like my little backpack for like a carry on. But I need like a. No, the backpack is not for a carry on. That's for like my gadgets and stuff. I need like a another size, something preferably with wheels. So maybe definitely a carry on. Um, I need something that can last me for like four well five days oh my god let's just see i'm gonna see if i can get a bag and i don't want to spend a lot of money on oh that's what we're doing let me head out let me get something to eat so i can sound more alive because right now i sound just like the worst like why do i sound like this oh my god you guys i'm just having an egg bacon and cheese croissant pretty plain pretty simple we're parked up outside target i'm just gonna eat and then we're gonna go inside So it's Noel's birthday in a few days and he's gonna be in Mexico and I won't be able to be with him so I just text him right I knew he wanted this Prada cologne ignore how I look cuz baby um, he wanted this Prada cologne I remember when we were um, in the store at um, Sephora one time and he was telling me he really liked that one so I messaged him friend this was the, the one that you said is nice and he's like oh my god man, that one smells so good and then he's now telling me are you gonna get that one for your son and I'm like yeah I was just trying to remember which one you said smells really good and he's now texting me back oh that one and the black one is amazing he don't know that it's for him mm -mm. he texting he don't know that it's for him <laughs> And I just picked him up a card, so I'm making him a little surprise because that's my friend, okay? Guys, would you believe I'm still outside? Um, I just went to TJ Maxx to return the stuff. It smells so smelly in there. I just did not want to go shop for anything. So I joined the line, returned the stuff. I went to Forever 21 before that. <sighs> Got some sweats from them and... Some other stuff. I never know to stick to the plan, y'all. And I'm now I'm just like tired. And I want to go home. It's like 12 o'clock. Like, what? Did we get in this car at 9? What was I doing? Oh my god. Um, I take forever. It's why I hate coming to like shop or do anything like that. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna go to Sephora right now to see if I can grab that fragrance for Noel. Shoot, and then I need a gift bag. I don't know. Why I didn't get that in Target? Oh, ugh, 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 ugh. But we're gonna go into Sephora and then 
I'm going to head home. I might have to go to the TJ Maxx that's closer to my house to get a gift bag and to see if I can get the luggage thing well, the bag that I was trying to get. But for right now, I'm exhausted and I'm about to head out. Oh my goodness. Let's do this again. Hey guys, so it's later on today. It's still Tuesday. It's like 528 right now. I was recording. I went and I did this wig a video so we got done with that it's a cute little closure wig nice and curly it's giving vacation and i i like it i think it's cute and guys i am trying a new foundation like today when i went to sephora i got a sample of the lancome ultra wear foundation not the glowy one not the new one the og one i think i've tried it in the past and i never took the plunge at buying it and today i was like in between um, my shades so the girl in the store gave me two different shades and I did try one the one that I'm wearing right now I feel like it's okay I feel like it goes but I feel like it's giving me like a vacation um kind of like skin skin tone can I talk I don't know I think it looks pretty for the most part um I don't know but the other color they're so close I will try the other color tomorrow because I do have a wig to do tomorrow so I'll definitely try it tomorrow I'm starving I'm starving I did buy some shrimp um, because I had stopped at Publix when I was coming home to get some um, some chicken that they have, some little popcorn, and is it popcorn chicken? Some little thing that they have at the bakery um, section. So bakery, the deli section. So that's what I got. But I was just filming um, the sponsored content for this vlog because I forgot. <laughs> and I have to put it in there. Guys, OMG, let me go get Noelle's gift and show it to you guys. So they didn't have the um, the fragrance that we went there for originally. I went to this Sephora and she's like, we don't carry it in this store. But um, the other Sephora, which was 30 plus minutes away, has that would have that fragrance um so then i asked her like you know like let me look around let me see if i find something else because this was like last maybe like last christmas he was saying he wanted it you know so i'm like maybe i can find something that smells nicer or whatever so we did look around um the lady was so nice she checked like what um what kind of ingredients sorry what kind of notes Ooh was in that fragrance and it was a citrus like woodsy kind of fragrance and then we found something let me show you i think he's gonna like this even more i ended up getting him the new ysl cologne it smells divine and if he doesn't like it i have the um the gift receipt in the bag because she did ask me um if i wanted that and i'm like sure because i'm like what if he you know it's not his vibe and he wants to switch it he has that chance but i feel like it smells so good i know my friend and it smelled good and it's like the same notes of the prada one that we were looking for so i feel like he's gonna love it um wait let me get it and remember how i said i needed a gift bag well i didn't know sephora did this the lady did it so nice for me i'm like oh my god okay we're not getting a gift bag so let me see if i can like take it out without messing it up this is the fragrance um and so it's ysl what is it called myself and it's a edp so that's great it'll last i don't like order toilets because those don't last oh my god and this one is a refillable um bottle okay so he can buy the refill wow this is good and this is two fluid ounces it smells heavenly i know he's gonna like it well i hope he does if not we have the gift receipt which i, I put in the bottom of the bag so he can go change it to something else and then we have the card um i need to take this out and write it up i'm gonna think about what i'm gonna put in there oh my god you ever want to talk i'm here to listen you ever want a drink i got a bottle of wine you ever want to break stuff i've got a sledgehammer heavy on the i've got the sledgehammer but we don't <laughs> i'm here for you oh my goodness oh my god why am i i feel like i want to cry oh my god i love my friend i really hope he you know he likes his gift i'm gonna write it up and then it has a great envelope so i'm 
going to put it on the inside as soon as I write it up and then drop it in the bag. I really was going to get him a gift bag, but you know what? Sephora did their thing. This is cute. Like, mm -mm. he going to throw it in the garbage anyway. So <laughs> this is his gift. And then I'm going to put it in the envelope, write it up and drop it on the inside. Um, I asked him if he was home today. He worked from his office. So he wasn't home. So I was checking like, what time are you going home? And he's just like, um, he's getting home at like five something, but he's going to some Halloween thing. I'm like, all right, what you doing tomorrow? He's going to his office for half the day and he's coming back home at one. I'm just like, oh, I'm gonna come see you. And he's like, what happened? Cause he's getting suspicious now. Cause I've been just asking him all kinds of stuff all day. And I'm like, oh no friend, um, nothing is going on. We can, we can meet up tomorrow. Maybe we can go eat some pizza. I don't like pizza, no one knows that, but he loves cheese pizza. So I'm just like, we can get some pizza. But then I forgot that he, you know, he's switching his diet around. So he's like, I haven't had pizza in four weeks. And I'm just like, okay, we can have a salad. But let's see, let's see, because I was trying to um, like trick him this morning like that I was like I really was trying to trick him and then he's like oh my god I love that fragrance you're getting it for your son and I'm like mm-hmm I'm just trying to remember which one you said you love because I know the one that you love smells so good I'm not getting it for my son <laughs> oh my god and then he's like oh my god they smell amazing he's gonna smell like a grown man I'm so dead um yeah so there's that and guys, I did get some stuff at Target, but it's not anything crazy. I want to see. Well, I guess. Um, let's go over here. Guys, my battery is dying. Okay. But it's okay. Um, I'm going to show you all these things really quickly. And I was supposed to go to the gym. Where? We have not gone to the gym all week. Today's Tuesday. So I got to get my life together. Okay. Um, this is the stuff from Forever 21. This was supposed to be... Not what's supposed to be it is a cropped um a cropped hoodie y'all can't really see it's a cropped hoodie i tried the medium on in the store and it fit like just too exact and i didn't like that so i got the large i don't know how it's gonna look so i'm gonna try that on really quickly before my battery dies and then i got the track pants like the sweatpants to match in the medium and so we're gonna we're gonna try that on i think my battery Hopefully y'all can see. And then I just got these. I love their, um, these high set they have, the biker tights. And they're pretty affordable. I have them like orange and another color. They're like $12.99 and they fit pretty good. So I saw the gray and I got it. Um, and then I got these sleeping pants, which I'm not sure about because apparently I'm not a small in the Forever 21, which is weird. So this is a sleeping pants, which I... I think they're so nice, they feel good, and they are a small. If they don't fit, we're bringing them back. They were $14.99, so I'm gonna try these really quickly. Oh, and look what I found at Target. They're these shower steamers. I don't know, I've never like used anything like this, but it's a lavender aroma, and you're supposed to just like place it on the wet floor, and then it'll give you like a lavender aroma. I just hit myself in the face, but I hope these are good. I'm going to try this today. And then we did get pajamas at Target. I got a robe. I got the Above the Stars robe. Let me see if I can push y'all back so y'all can see me. Okay, I got the Above the Stars robe. It feels so soft, y'all. Like, it's so soft. And I love the color. And I got the extra small to the small because it's very stretchy. Um, and then I got the dress. This was a dress that I was telling you about, the night dress. Because it's easy to put on, it's very comfy, and you just button it in the front. So that's perfect for me. I'm going to see if these things fit, and then I will show you guys quickly, and I'm going to put my phone on my phone. I'm going to put my camera to short. Guys, I honestly don't know if you can see the, the outfit, but I love the large. It's not tight. The medium was a little bit too, you know, like exact, I feel. It could work, but it just looked too exact. I love how this looks. Oh my God. Oh, no pockets. I love this. And it's a crop, so it's fitted right here. I love that. And the pants fit so good. Oh, let's see if I can show y'all. Okay, I have to turn this off. But can y'all see? Wow. It feels so nice on my body. Like the pants are so comfy. This is the medium. 
and then the top I got a large this looks so good I love it I love it love 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 that the top isn't too oversized the medium was like very exact but I feel like with a little bit of wiggle room it's more comfy for me so that's what it's looking like it's what the back looks like small could not fit my body and I'm just like I'm not that sick <laughs> but the small could not fit but I love the vibe okay my pad my battery is totally about to die but I just got an Amazon package and I wanted to quickly just show you guys I saw people doing their eyelashes on TikTok so look what I ordered it's one of those kits that brings all the stuff to do your eyelashes I don't know how <laughs> this is gonna go what wait what color is this this doesn't even look like black oh it says black band but the lashes look brown hold on do they come in different colors did I just buy like a brown color um I don't know if it's black or what it is but the lashes they look brown to me but I saw somebody on TikTok do this and I'm just like oh I'm gonna try doing my own lashes they really look like uh brown lashes but we're gonna see how this goes it's like cluster lashes it's a whole DIY kit we're gonna try this out not right now clearly um maybe like tomorrow I don't know but I did buy it this is what it looks like let me turn this off so you guys can see oops I don't do that hey babes good morning it is Wednesday today's November 1st yay happy happy new month like we got a 61 days until the new year do you count today in the 61 well we got 61 days 60 to 61 days left for this year and I just pray to God that this last you know couple of days be the best that we've seen all year like God is about to blow our minds you know everything God promised us for this year it's gonna come to completion before the end of the year and I firmly believe that and I just feel so excited like I'm in my sweater on my hoodie and my little sweatpants because it was 60 something degrees earlier well now it's 65 me and Paxson went for a walk and it was just so nice I didn't want to come inside the wind and then we went by the lake and it just felt nice and like chilly but you know it's Florida so that don't last so I was just enjoying that and I was just outside feeling so grateful I don't know I feel super happy I'm just so grateful and guys let me show you Paxson come here don't be acting stank he doesn't like being picked up but he has his little look at his little can y'all see him his little hoodie that I got him it says apple picking crew like he looks so cute look say hi to the people say hi you look good he looks so good and the color with his fur I don't know it looks I didn't know it was gonna look this good he looks so good and outside when we was walking in like in the nice natural light he just looked really good sir hello say hi is it it's 907 I did get up earlier today again I want to head to Trader Joe's they open at 8 so I think now is a good time to head over there why do I feel hot I feel hot in the house I think I should probably put like a top under this so once I get outside and Florida starts being Florida I can take the top off because baby I feel hot but outside feels nice and chill Trader Joe's is 30 minutes away so it's 9 25 right now it says we're gonna get there in 9 54 yeah, let's go, because, I mean, do I really need to go, though? Guys, we have a pit stop. We're at Wawa, because why did I forget? I need a guess. I literally put the GPS in, and it's when I'm heading on the highway. I'm like, wait, you need gas. But I had 47 miles, and we were going, like, 24, I think. Now I have... 23 miles, wow. So we just stopped at Wawa. How much is gas today? Oh my god. <laughs> gas would be so expensive. Ooh, and it's chilly outside. Hold on. Because I thought, y'all just gonna have to stay like that. I'm sorry. I thought, like, you know, like it calmed down. You see how I'm planning? It's gonna get so hot. So I have my tank top thingy on. Ow. My nails hurt so bad. I'm going to the nail shop on 
Friday. I can't wait. My nails hurt so bad. In half a mile, turn Siri, right Siri, line. relax. She's always just like, girl, we stopped. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me. Okay. Oh, I need my phone for that. So, the guess is I guess it's not too bad today. It's three dollars and something. Guys, it is so overcast. Look at the sky. Like it is so Oh, it is just like crazy. Yesterday was really hot. Oh my goodness. And then guys, there's a Sephora right there. I think I want to go over there because the, um, what foundation, the Lancome, um, ultra wear foundation that I got yesterday, I got two colors, but the one that I used yesterday, I think it looked pretty good. But when I went back on there, um, it was telling me that I'm another shade because the second shade that I got, it's definitely off, but the one that I used yesterday, it looked pretty good to me, but when I like matched my foundation, what I already have with the website, it's showing me like another shade. So since I'm like right here, I'm just going to pop in there and ask them for a sample of that color. Hopefully they have it. I can get a sample and then I can do my makeup today and try it. And then we're going to get one. The Sephora still is still going on and I want to grab something before it ends. I literally need to get stuff by tomorrow. I think it ends soon i don't know i don't remember but i want to grab the foundation and i also want to top up on my skincare i need to get the um the moisturizer that i'm using right now it's really really good and it's almost at the pan like i'm almost hitting pan i'm like wow i really do use this a lot i use it night and day on my skin so i want to get that um what other thing do I need? And I want to get the foundation. I don't really need anything else. I know that they're having a sale, but honestly, I don't need anything. I'm not going to buy what I don't need just because they're having a sale. So I think that's pretty much it. And I might get like um, a cologne for my son, like another cologne. I don't know, another fragrance. Okay, my gas is done. Hold on. Guys, this lady has a whole... Um, every time I use this, this thing, oh my God, it went right up into the ceiling. But this lady... I'm crying. She has like a whole shopping bag over her hand to pump the gas. <laughs> I feel you, girl. <laughs> She's like, ain't nobody going to get me sick. She literally has a shopping bag over her hand pumping the gas. Like, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm not that, like, anal. That's the word. Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't like this. Um, this is from Trader Joe's, actually, but it's so sticky. I don't like it. I don't. I like the one that they have that's like the spray, little tiny spray bottle one. I'm going to get one of those today. Those are not sticky. Okay, let me turn the car on. I'm going to run, ac not run across the street literally, but let me add a stop to Sephora first so I can go get the foundation sample and then Trader Joe's is right there and then we're going home because baby, I'm, I want to go home. Like, it's so far to get here. What is... Why is she not adding this stop? Oh my god, Siri is so aggravating. I'm literally like typing, typing the stop and it disappeared. Guys, um, do y'all see a little blusher that I have on? I don't know. But I saw this Sephora collection like blushing palette thing that they had in the store yesterday. I don't think y'all are seeing it. Just a little bit, not a lot, because she was trying to see what it looks like on my skin. I think it's cute. I don't know. I didn't go in there to buy anything, but anyways. <laughs> I wanted this little um, palette that they have. It's like a blush, a bronzer, and something else. And I thought it looked really nice, you know, so it comes with four shades. They didn't have this one at the other store because it comes in two colors. The lighter one was available, and then they didn't have it online, and they have it here. So I bought it because I felt like that was my sign to buy, don't you think? And I've been wanting to get this um, Sephora gloss in. It's a nude lip gloss. 
um it's xxl nude it's a plump lip gloss too i wanted to buy this from like last sephora sale but it was always out of stock so i saw it and i got it hopefully it looks nice um i did get my sample of my lancome tint Adol. and yeah that's it we didn't go to buy anything i got my sample and then i was talking to the lady and then I asked her about this and it was there so I took it. We're going to do our makeup today because I do have a wig that I'm going to do. So we're going to do our makeup today. We're going to get pretty. Um, and she gave me a sample. She's like, here's another sample. She gave me good girl. I know what good girls smell like, but it's cute. I can just use this as like a one-off. So that's nice. That was really nice of them. We're going to go to Trader Joe's now. It's 1017. We're finally going to go do what I came on the road to do. I don't think I'm going to bring my camera in there. I'm trying to be in and out, if I'm being honest. So I guess once I get the groceries or whatever I find. But guess what? We're never doing this again for right now. I'm not driving 30 minutes to go to Trader Joe's. Like, I don't know. We're going to have to just stick to going to Publix, even though I hate some of the flowers like their florals are just really trash you know like Publix florals florals but yeah i mean i'm not even like buying flowers like that as before um but i just love going to trader joe's to be honest um but 30 minutes every time we're not gonna do that I got this orange juice from them that I wanted to try because I'm thirsty anyways. It's a cold pressed orange juice. I'm going to see if it's any good. But we're going to head out. 27 minutes to go home, bro. Well, 28. Yo. Guys, I made it in the house. And this man was trying to help me. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Like, I brought, like, three of my bags. And I guess he's working on a unit in the building. And he couldn't get in. So he was trying to get in the building. Um... Anyways, then he's like, oh, I'm coming back to help you. I'm like, I'm good, sir. I only have one left. But then he did come back to help me one of the bags. The one bag, like this bag was my coconut water. And I'm just like, oh, my God. And then he's like asking me what I'm making for lunch. And he's trying to earn some lunch. I'm like, sir. Mm. And then he's like, oh, I can help you put them in. I'm like, no, that's okay. No, thank you. Thank you for bringing the bag upstairs to me. We're good. Like, sir, stop playing with me. Um, anyways, I'm going to put you guys in the other tripod so I can empty what I got from the store. And then I'm going to eat something. I'm hungry. Let me see what I got from Trader Joe's. Oh, I was drinking this in the car. It's decent. It's like a cold press. I've never had a cold press orange juice, but it's okay. I don't know. It doesn't taste like anything special. I want to go to the gym, but I think I need to eat something. I got some sweet potato fries. I, I was craving sweet potato fries the other day. And I made some from scratch, but then I just wanted to have some accessible that if I feel like making it. So we got that. We got my favorite, Hold the Dairy Cones. My sister clowns me every time I have these because she's like, they're so tiny. You need to eat whole, the whole box. Even though it does say one serving is six, it comes to 12. I only have like one at a time. I don't know. Um, what is this? Oh, and we did get a lot of like meat stuff. So got some legs and some thighs. And I'm thinking I should not put these in the freezer. I should season them and then put them in the freezer because yeah, it makes more sense. And then I did get some salmon. I know I will cook a packet of this. And then the other one, I think I just want to freeze it. I won't even like do anything to it. I'll just like freeze it. So I'm gonna leave one out. Should just cook this today. Mm -hmm. And then I'll freeze the other one. And then I got, oh, butter. I was out of like butter. And then got some pineapple juice, which is good. I'm gonna need that. Got a banana bread mix. I wanna make banana bread. Um, I'll see if I'm gonna make this. Do I have the, the thing to make it in? I don't even know. And then avocados, garlic. I got some granola. I bought this before and I got it to try again. This is peanut butter granola. This is a tomato. Yeah. It's a lot of veggies, to be honest. Like a lot of veggies. And then this is a sweet potato. 
And then we got their coconut milk because if you used to watch my vlogs like from earlier, I always get their coconut milk because it's so good, especially in rice and peas. I love it. So I got like four cans. What is this? Oh, I got an avocado spray. Yeah, I got four cans of coconut milk. And I'm just putting everything on the counter and then I can just put them away. Um, cucumber. We got bell peppers. What I plan to do is to cut all the bell peppers up and put them in Ziplocs. Maybe that'll make them last longer. And then when I'm ready to use them, I can just like slide them out the fridge. And then my eggs. Oh my God. Okay. They're all good. They're not broken. So we got eggs. We got some broccoli, which we can have today as well. And then guys, I got these pork chops, but they look so pretty. I know that's a weird way to talk about pork chops, but don't they look like lamb chops? They look nice. Look at how, oh my goodness, the shape. I think these are going to be so good. Um, I'm going to put these in the freezer because I'm not going to make them right now. So I'm going to freeze them. I feel like I should season all the meats and then put them in the freezer, but I'm just like so lazy. Um, I'm going to eat something and then I'm going to make my own coffee because we didn't have any coffee today. So I'm going to make my own iced coffee and then I'm going to season all these meat stuff because I still would have to do them. So I'm going to season them and put them in the freezer. So for next week, well, not next, next week and the week afterwards, I can just, if when I start cooking again, I can just slide them out and thaw them out and just cook them without the stress and the strain of trying to like prepare it. So that's what I'm trying to make stuff easier for me. Got some cinnamon rolls. Their cinnamon rolls are really good. I got some more smoothies. I got some smoothies yesterday from Publix. Um, wow, and they're mango smoothies too. I don't know, I love mango. I was drinking this one yesterday, the naked one. I'm winded. I just got in from the gym. Let me tell you how outside is cool. Like, howl. <laughs> Let me stop, but it, why is it cold outside? It was hot because I was in the gym working out, but when I stepped outside, it is chilly. So I hurried my little behind in the house. And let me tell you how I stopped to check my comments on TikTok. Why couldn't y'all tell me? Netflix <laughs> has my filler little like episode on their new series. Oh my goodness. Let me get the remote. You know what's funny? The other day, I was watching the TV and I paused it. I don't know where my remote is. That is kind of crazy, I know. But I was watching TV, someone called me, and I literally paused the TV and I can't find the remote. So I'm going to get the remote from my room because it works. They're both like Samsung. But we're going to click on that Netflix series. It's called, like I think, The Black Beauty Effect. I'm going to check, but I didn't know. And when the person told me, like she's like, you know... You're on the new Netflix series. I said, huh? Me? <laughs> what? How? They were talking about fillers and like they're talking like beauty treatments for black women. And they were talking about fillers, like stuff like that. And they were saying black women do get fillers. They're talking about aging or skin and things that we do. And literally, when they was talking about the fillers, my, let me stop, my video of when I got my under eye fillers, remember that video when I first got under eye fillers, that clip of me getting my under eye fillers is on there, like, how sway, how, Netflix, your people need to call my people and we need to talk together, I'm playing, um, but I'm gonna go find the remote, well, use the one in my room because I don't know where the other one is. And we're gonna click so I can show it to you guys. I'm so excited because I feel like it's so taboo. Um, like people think if you're a woman of color, like women of color don't get fillers or certain beauty treatments. And I thought that too until I actually got my fillers. And honestly, it's the best thing I ever did. Like one of the best things, the best thing I ever did was just give my life to Jesus, you should too. But it's one of the best things I've ever done for myself because I had really baggy hollow under eyes and I always looked really, really tired and it really drastically improved my appearance in terms of I didn't look tired, I looked refreshed. And all of that. I'm going to make a new video about my fillers um, coming up because I am going to go see my injector in a while because I haven't had under eye fillers in like two years. The last time I went, I only got like a little bit of cheek just to balance out my face. I didn't feel like I wanted more under eye filler. So I'm just going to see her um, next week, actually. So there'll be a video on that. It'll be like a follow up and like 
I will actually have the injector talking to you guys so you can get like details if you are ever interested in doing like fillers. I'm not promoting like saying you should, but if it's for you and you feel like it's something that you want to do, then definitely do your research. But yeah, let me get the remote. The, of the, whole industry. the black beauty and effect, girls. Okay, okay. Look, 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 because I had to wake up like, wait, 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 okay. Is it a lie ago, like loss of pigment or too much pigment? I always say that the brown spot is the wrinkle of dark skin. Darker skin oh my goodness. responds to trauma. Let's like see. That's why we tan The sun is actually damaging. We darken up. Can we hear it? Skin from the sun. Keratosis pilaris. A lot of people have strawberry legs. Like, no one was talking about that stuff 10 years ago. We get the dark circles around our eyes and melasma. For black women, it's where our wow. face shows. All of a sudden, you wake up one day like, what the hell? Where did that come from? Why well, I look so tired? Now there are dermatologists who are doing chemical peels that are safe for the eye area. You can get filler. A lot of African Americans come in and say, oh, do, do black people do those type of procedures? And I'm like, uh, yeah, I'm Botox right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God! Let me relax, baby. Y'all couldn't tell me. I was. Oh shoot, I'm doing a lot. I'm doing too much. Did you see a girl on Netflix? Oh shoot, Did you see a girl on Netflix with my baggy yeah, under yeah, eyes at the time. Industry. Let me mute everyone. this because I'm doing too much. But your girl is on Netflix. <laughs> Netflix. Y'all needs to talk to my people. Um, but this is such a cool uh, documentary. I think all like the big beauty pioneers and leaders are just like giving insight on like black women and like inclusion in beauty stuff and like different things that we generally don't talk about so i feel like am i in focus i feel like this is an amazing thing to watch and the fact that they put your girl on there stop playing with her like i can talk to me anyhow that is so cool and I didn't know someone actually commented under my video to tell me that hey there's like a new Netflix thing and you're on there like this video I'm like are you serious <laughs> that's so cool that's so cool okay let me stop guys I'm going to make something to eat I'm starving um I'm gonna make some salmon even though there's no seasoning or anything on it so I don't know how that's gonna taste but I'm gonna season it right now and then I'm gonna go make it because I'm hungry. I'm not doing the video today, as I told you guys, but I wanna go see Noel. He, I don't know where he is, but I wanna go see him. So I'm gonna try making dinner, grabbing myself a nice little shower and then checking in with him to see where he is. And then we're gonna go deliver his gift. Hopefully he is at home. And y'all, so my nails came off. Why? Why? In two days, your girl's on Netflix. Hey babes, it's like later in the evening. I what did I do? I cooked, I made salmon, rice, and some steamed vegetables. Took Paxton for a walk. It's chilly outside, so I have my sweater back on. And then I I took a shower and I washed my face. I didn't do my skincare, so I'm gonna do some skincare. But we're gonna go to Noel's really quickly. I told him I'm bring him some dinner because he didn't cook. So I'm gonna share him like a little plate. He has a tendency of not returning my con- Y'all, my memory card was full. Anyways, I'm gonna make him a plate really quickly and then we're gonna head over there. I'm gonna put some moisturizer on first because I did not do any skincare on my skin. He's so dry. I told him I was bringing him food and he's like, oh, that sounds so good. But what I was saying is no one never returns my little glass container. So he's getting plastic today. Um, yeah, and I need to ride in his car really quickly. I'm gonna take Paxson with me so he can get a little drive outside and then he can see Noel's dog. I forgot that he had a new dog so he can see Noel's dog. Okay, so this is Noel's plate. We got some broccoli, some carrots, some green beans, some rice, and a nice piece of salmon. I hope he enjoys it. Let me go write the card up and then we're gonna go. Food is right there in his gift because I didn't want to slide off the chair. Okay, I'm gonna be driving. Paxson! Oh, you ready? He he ready. He in the front. <laughs> Let's go. Why are you in short shorts and it's cold? I know it's freezing. Why was I? Why are you not on the phone? My phone. I left it back. Oh, that's what yeah, I'm saying. Come in. If I'm supposed to park over there. Oh, you can park anywhere you want. 
Why is he crying? Because he's gonna get out. Anyways, huh? open the door right there and take your take your stuff out of my car. It's locked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, what's this, friend? It's, it's your dinner, and then yeah, it's something else for you. Oh my god! So take your take your your dinner. I put it in the seat because I didn't want it to turn <laughs> off. <laughs> I'm so stupid. You gotta heat it up. Uh, I'm. You're not know eating just like no. This. And then that's, that's oh it, my that's gosh, me. what is this? You can check it inside. Are you want to see it now? It's cold as hell. I'm gonna get packed out I'm of this. I want to see it now. Okay. Listen, I've been feeling a bit emotional lately. <laughs> well, happy early birthday, friend. I love you. I'm not gonna be able to be in Mexico, and I just want you to know that you're appreciated. You always show up for me, so I want you to know that. Did you just? We can't be serious. We're not big friends. <laughs> Uh, look, check what it is. I don't know. And I there's a gift receipt in case you, you know it's not what you want. But I feel like I know you, and it lines up with the, the scent, the, the kind of vibe that you're on. So mm -hmm. you're crying. Oh my god, friend. Oh, friend. Literally, I love you so much, and you mean a lot to me. And I don't have that many people like around. Now my voice is crying. You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> so I just wanted you to know. And I really wanted, you know, to like be with you on your birthday trip. And I'm not able to, so I want you to know that you're appreciated nonetheless. I love you. I'll well, come give you a hug because it's cold as hell. And then there's a card. So you need to read the card. The card is the part that got me the most. Baby. You need to read what it says. <laughs> Why are you crying? We're having a moment. And he's crying because he wanna get out of the car. <laughs> and then you can go eat your dinner. And you can take your shower and you can just like go spray in your new cologne and just <laughs> i know right i have a new shower i think oh my god and you need to try the cologne and if not there's a gift receipt oh my friend you see what it's oh my god i'm gonna go give you oh god i love you so much <laughs> <Yeah. Ooh>. oh. <laughs> girl I love you. oh my god you're my favorite i love you so so much and i know <sighs> You see what it says? I'm heavy on the list. Yeah. Okay? That's my favorite part. Where is he? That's it. Oh, he wa oh you want to get in on the birthday love? I'm heavy on the list. Okay? <laughs> oh. I love you. You're my person. God knew like we were supposed to cross paths. Like, for oh, sure. And I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah, you're the first person to see me. <laughs> oh, I love you. I love you. I, I love you. Oh Literally, just smelling this is Sephora. Is Sephora. Ask Isaac. Oh my God. <laughs> that is so... Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. This is oh my God. <laughs> now I'm extra happy because it's something that you actually want. Yeah. I literally smelled it. I'm like, man, this smells good. I ain't got my advice though. Uh, baby, we out in Cancun smelling nice. A period. We smell like money and it's EDP okay. so it lasts longer. It's a perfume. Okay. Mm. We gonna be yep, out here smelling it. like money. Oh my god. <laughs> this is it. Yes. Ah, it looks like you. It's your style. I, I, Baby. Yeah. Yeah. And I was tricking you because uh, I was asking you about the fragrance. It was for you. When I asked that oh, product really? thing, but when I, I went to the store, it. they didn't have it. So I said to her, uh, what are the notes in that product? And she's like, this smells she so showed good. me others. And I'm like, this was the closest one. I'm like, I feel like this you I'm would like. smell like a bone, sexy. Man, period. Oh my god, I'm so good. Okay, so we did good. Oh. <laughs> I'm so happy I made you cry. I did that. <laughs> oh my god, friend. Definitely did. Yay. Yeah, I think I <laughs> We're gonna beat that part out. That's his best friend. We're gonna beat that part out. You didn't hear that. <laughs> Oh my god. I just want you to feel special and appreciated because you really are my person. You show up for me, even though you take forever and I be cussing you, but you do show up for you me. me. And I don't have a lot of people that show up for me, so I love you so much. I love you too. I love you too. I'm so happy that you like it. Look at this fool over here. Pax it. You know what? You know what? You know what? You so cute You just want to be outside. You're going to cry now. You're going to eat your food and cry. Yes. And when you shower, you're going to try it to see how it wears on you. You're going to be selling so good. I'm gonna be making a Why good. sell me? You can put it okay. on your little pictures when you're on vacation. Uh, period. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Paxton is naked because he was playing with Noelle's dog and she almost just like ate him alive. Like she was so. She plays so much. His shirt is full of like slob. So I took it off. 
go inside. Even though she's a puppy, y'all, she's like 25 pounds and Paxton is like 12 pounds. We're going home. We're going home. Let me put these things down. Tell the vlog bye. Tell the people them bye. Say bye bye, Paxton. Guys, this is where I'm going to end this vlog. It was an amazing time. Um, I'm going to my yard. Didn't I close the door right? I don't know my dog falling out. I think it's closed, but yeah. It was a good time. And our surprise was amazing. Today's Wednesday, Noel's birth Noel's birthday is Monday, and then he's going on his birthday trip on Friday. So I went in to be early and I wanted to make sure, you know, he felt the love and I'm so happy that he did. My windows look dirty. Okay, <laughs> well, let's go home. Catch you guys in my next one. If you haven't liked this video, please like it now. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, girl. Support your girl, okay? Like, subscribe, comment. Catch you in my next one. Say bye, Paxson. Peace out. Because he going home naked because he don't know how to act. Anyways, bye, guys.